After more than a decade playing the violin for the popular Dave Matthews Band, one member is stepping out on his own and taking some very different musical paths on his new CD. Get the inside scoop on True Reflections when CNN Headline News returns. One member of the Dave Matthews Band isn't fiddling around with his new CD. Denise Kwan has more on the first member of the band to release a solo album. It's the rock and roll version of Pavlov's Dogs. Every time Boyd Tinsley steps into the spotlight for a violin solo, thousands of people burst into applause. But there's nothing more fun than to be jamming with the Dave Matthews Band with, you know, 20, 30,000 people, you know, and jamming with a violin and rocking the crowd, which is pretty awesome. The celebrated fiddler is the first member of the Dave Matthews Band to release a solo album. True Reflections showcases his skill as a songwriter, and yes, that's his voice on lead vocals. What was it like, though, getting up to that microphone oh, for the first it time? Scary. It was scary because I'm so used to having this violin in one hand and a bow in the other. You know, it was just like nothing but just like a mic. Usually, Tinsley leaves microphone duties to Matthews, although he will accompany him on the occasional red carpet. Whenever Dave does an arrivals line, he's got you right by his side. <laughs> I'm a security blanket, you know. <laughs> Where's BT? You know, no, it's Dave and I are a really good team when we do stuff like that. You know, I'm sort of like the uh, was it the guy that uh, sets up the jokes. What do you call him? <laughs> the straight man. The straight man. No, I I'm the I'm the straight man. <laughs> Wish list for Christmas: a tall, black, handsome man like you. <laughs> boy Tinsley is here. How are you, boy? I'm doing great, man. How you doing? Before a recent guest appearance on Jimmy Kimmel Live, before two decades with the Grammy-winning Dave Matthews Band, Tinsley was just another 12-year-old public school kid choosing an elective. Well, you started playing violin by accident, wasn't it? Totally. I, want, I signed up for a string class, thinking I was going to play the guitar, you know, in middle school. And I go in there and it's like a string orchestra class, you know. So, I mean, I chose the violin just because I was there and I had to play something, you know. But I, I fell in love with the instrument. you learn about yourself, your talents, you know, your likes and dislikes doing this solo album? When I first started this, I didn't really know that I was going to be able to successfully write songs, you know, so it's cool to know that I can do that, and, and it's cool to know that I was able to, to also sing them. True reflections from a man who isn't fiddling around. Denise Kwan, CNN, Los Angeles.